I realized that I can do whatever I want to with it. I became like the Lego master builder. I don't really need the instructions. I can build my own thing. But the way I teach it to people is think of a video game. You can build your own avatar and you always start with blank slate. That's your basic voice. Just that blank, plain, humanoid shape. Then you add on the skin, you add on the texture, you add on the teeth, the hair, the style, the color of the hair, the type of eyes, how big the eyes, small. You can micromanage that character. You're building a character. You can do the same thing with your voice. You start off with your own voice and you add a layer to it because now he's he's deep. Now maybe now he's southern. Maybe now he's got a lisp. And you just keep on adding layers till you've invented a whole new character. And then for me, I just talk that way for a whole day until it annoys everybody else. But then it's locked in and then I have like a cool character and I give him a name and a catchphrase. A lot of people have catchphrases for a character, whether it's a celebrity sound alike or not. For Tracy Morgan, for example, it's like, my name is Tracy Morgan and I got you pregnant. You know, it's like, <laughs> that just instantly reminds me of all the things that make Tracy Morgan sound like Tracy Morgan. And for Ryan Reynolds, it's like, oh, hi there. How are you? 